All right, ladies and gentlemen, I have been uh, the delay in this because my NVIDIA Shield was not working, and this is, of course, the number one box on the market right now. I, you know, spent the money for it. It plays video games, etc., etc. But I'm going to show you a little demonstration of how to use Kodi. Um, a lot of new people that um, get these Android boxes, even, even Fire Sticks, just do not understand some of the concepts. But now I don't have a recording limit, so I can show you pretty much any damn near thing you can see. So I'm going to go to Cody. Don't worry about my screen because you don't have the same screen as me. But I'm going to go to Cody. And I'm going to launch it. It's going to go to 16.1. You're always going to see some little intro of this, whether it be my build or somebody else's. But I usually have a video build, and it usually goes from the theme of what it is. Um, give it a few seconds here, and it'll load. So the one thing I do ask you guys to remember is to, when you first load up your boxes or your fire stick or whatever, just kind of remember that that still needs to take some time to update. It does automatic updates. Um, you will see that I'm on something a little bit stronger, so it didn't really, it's not really going to lag anything on my end. Um, but I'm going to actually go to um, the programs tab or systems tab and actually check a look and see if everything is updated or so let's go to add-ons okay so there was no updates usually whenever there is updates there are going to be updates right there it'll say update available but it looks like the auto updates are fixed again so that's good um damn we got thunderstorms again tonight and tomorrow <clears throat> so a little bit about this Everybody asks me, where do I find certain things? Well, you do have to kind of look for it because I'm not your tech support to look for things like that. But I do have things labeled. Um, I'm going to start with the first tab that you will see. It's called Favorites. Of course, that's going to be where your favorites go. Um, and I'll eventually teach you how to do that as well. But let's go to the next tab. So Shield, it is actually add-ons. If you go to the regular Cody screen, you'll see a thing called just um, add-ons or system or anything like that. I just kind of made it everything uh, to go with the theme. So Shield, of course, is Shield from you know the Avengers and the Marvel. Um, I have a few shortcuts down here. So a lot of people are asking me, where's the Thunder games at? I want to watch the playoff games. I want to watch the regular season games. Hell, I want to watch whatever team. So basically what I have here is I have the Oklahoma City Thunder here. And I'm going to click it. And as you notice, it actually can show you the older games. But it will actually show you tomorrow's game as well. <clears throat> Let's go to the next one. Where's Game of Thrones? Same thing. So this is the new season right here, season 6. You'll be able to watch episode one. On Sunday, you'll be able to see two. And the next Sunday, number three. Walking Dead, season's over. But guess what? It doesn't mean your season's over. You can rewatch from the first season to the sixth season. It doesn't matter. <clears throat> Showtime. Everybody loves movie channels. Well, I put a shortcut here just because I know that a lot of people still watch a lot of these shows. And there you go. I mean, I have different little shortcuts for everything. Netflix. Why do I need my Netflix account whenever I can just use the Cody account? Or Cody. And there you go. Everything that's on Netflix. Fuller House. Uh, pretty amazing. How about we go to the next one? And that would be Stars. There you go. All the star shows. Never saw Black Cells. I heard it was really good, though. Um, and then, finally... Oh, that was it. So HBO is also on there somewhere too, but you don't have I don't have that on there because most people just watch Game of Thrones anyways on there. So let's go to the next tab. Movies and shows. So I merged everything all together because it was basically looking too cluttered. So say if I want to watch a movie. Well I'm gonna actually click on movies and shows. And it was already taking me into Exodus, which is the number one um, app that uh, or add-on that's on here. So I'm gonna go back to Exodus and I'm gonna show you the full screen. So you can either choose from movies, TV shows, channels, my list, latest movies, latest episodes, tools, search, etc. Search is an amazing thing because, hey, I want to see a movie or, let's see, let's go to movies, yeah. Well, hell, there's a keyboard on here. So let's type in, oh, let's say Harry Potter. Not only do you just put in a few words, <clears throat> you actually can click down here and it'll auto-complete for you, so you don't have to search for everything. There you go. Well, wh what if I want to put that in my favorites? Unfortunately, Exodus <laughs> did not allow people to put this stuff in their favorites anymore, and I don't know why. 
but you can add it to your queue and you can add it to your track list or anything like that. But there you go. I mean, it's that simple. Why go to Redbox anymore? Why go to On Demand when you can just buy, you know, buy a box and have the unlimited world, you know, in your hands? Um, same with TV shows. I want to go to TV shows. I can search by genre, certificates, networks, people watching, most popular, airing today, returning TV shows, new TV shows, highly rated, most voted, you get the freaking picture. <laughs> I mean, it just has every little list on here. You can even do people search. I would not know very many actors on that. Maybe Stephen Amell for my wife. That's about it. Channels. This one's a new one to me, but it looks like it's movies that have aired on Sky, Sky Network. Yeah. There's other movies you can watch. But say you do want to watch a new movie. Say you want to watch a movie in theaters. It's not recommended. I'm not going to lie to you. It's not recommended. Go to most popular is what I mostly do. But I went to movies. Most popular. And there you go. Would I recommend watching this? I'm going to show you. It's not going to be the best picture because this movie just came out last Friday. Is it the worst? No, by all means. But let's load it up here. It's going to be a standard definition. I'm not going to play too much of it because I don't want copyrights. <laughs> YouTube taking my stuff down. Give it about 30 seconds to a minute. Because it is pulling from the source. And if it doesn't work, it's the Jungle Book. Go see that in theaters. I heard it's amazing anyways. <clears throat> Yeah, it's not going to work. It's a brand new movie. Or is it working? It's working. It's just taking its sweet little time. Give it a second here. And I'm on 200 megabytes per second of internet. So anybody that says, oh, I have the fastest internet. Well, I'm still having issues too. It's not perfect by all means. But whenever this is the, you know, number one... Oh, wow. Oh, hell yeah. I'm going to be watching this tonight, then. That's a really good picture for the Jungle Book that just came out. Like, wow. I'm actually kind of impressed on that myself here. Let me see if I can skip to a few scenes here. Maybe we can get to it. That's watchable. That's 100% watchable. I am impressed. I'll be damned. Okay. So there you go. There's Star Wars, Cloverfield, The Revenant, Deadpool. I don't know why Deadpool is not on there anymore. It's missing. Or it's just the icon. All these other movies you can watch. You don't have to go to Redbox. You don't have to, you know, buy these on DVD. I have the hiccups. I cannot wait for the next Captain America. As you can tell, Civil War is what this is called. So that's just one app. Let's go to the next one. Let's go to Phoenix. There you go. You have more add-ons inside the add-ons. I'm going to show you one of my favorite add-ons here, though. And I'm going to go to 124215. I'm going to change the view because I love the icons. Oh, yes, they added new stuff. New releases. Let's take a look at this one. Hey, you guys that like prints, there you go. Watch his, you know, 2020 special. Oh, Daniel Tosh. Okay. So there's all sorts of stuff you guys just don't even understand. This is why I sell these because you can literally get rid of cable. Don't ever say there's nothing ever to watch because I'm going to lie. And you're going to lie. You're going to lie on your bed and watch TV all day. That's what we're going to do. Look, there's the boss. It's already on here. Okay. I'm kind of really curious about the Lego animation. Everything is awesome on Cody. That is true. Mob Wives. That's another one, I guess. Wow. But just look at the menu. I just love how you can look through different things. The best of Batman. Who doesn't love the Batman? DC comic movies. Every Marvel movie. I'm not kidding you. Every Marvel movie. Here you go. This is why I sell these. Because this literally, like I said, you don't have to have Netflix. You don't have to go out... When the hell did that come out? That's weird. <clears throat> Everything. Every little thing you can think of. 3D movies. If you have a 3D TV, you can try it. Hallmark movies. Lifetime movies. The funniest comedians ever. I mean, it's just all labeled. So that's just one other tab I love. Stream all the sources, same as Exodus. Specto, same as Exodus. <laughs> These are all just different things you can look for movies and shows. Um, let's go to the next one. Live television. Is live television my favorite? 
By all means, no. Is it awesome to use sometimes? Uh, let's see, did this update? No, I haven't updated it yet. Not by, you know, a long shot. But let's go to channel pair. This is one of the major ones everybody uses. You can watch live channels. That does not mean they're going to be in HD. It doesn't mean they're going to be in the best quality. But, you know, whatever. I mean, it's free. Go over to... I mean, look at all these channels. These are literally all the channels you can watch. Are they all in American? No. Are they all in Canada? No. They're everywhere. Um, Pac-12 stuff, when football comes on, you can watch it. 24-7 <laughs> King of the Hill. That's way too much propane for me, buddy. It's just it's just non-stop channels. Are these local? No. And they will never be local. I will never support local because I'm not going to get in trouble. But you have different things you can watch. Say you want to go to Live Mix. You actually have a little guide here. Uh, I don't know what the hell E3 is, or 3E is, but uh, let's go to USA, please. <laughs> and let's go to AMC. And it may not work. I'm not really sure. I don't really mess with the live channels. Oh, it's going to work. Okay, cool. Like I said, I'm on 200 megabytes per second. Let's see. Nope. Okay. So, I mean, that's, that happens. Live television. It's, it's a pain in the ass. How about Cartoon Crazy? Let's go to Disney. Every Disney movie you can think of. Why would you want to, you know, have all those VHSs just gathering dust when you can just watch them all digitally? There you go. There's Aladdin, Muppets, everything you can think of. The Mighty Ducks. If you like hockey, there you go. It, it's just un believable how much stuff is on here and i and i just under, don't understand how come a lot of people are under, not understanding where to look because you guys aren't really looking i think sometimes but i don't mind helping um, let's go to the next one here's what the money maker makes this is all sports castaway sports devil money sports sports mix all wrestling if you missed the ufc fight last saturday guess what you can watch it you can watch it right now there you go let's go to the next tab Let's go to WB. You missed a show of Raw. There you go. You can watch Monday Night Raw from last last week. SmackDown, anything. Let's go to the next thing here. Castaway. Fully updates. There you go. He he makes this thing pretty much unstoppable. Um, let's go to live sports. I usually go to dim sports and some other ones, but. I want to watch all the basketball games. Well, I want to watch Pacers in Toronto or, you know, Portland and Clippers. And it's a nobody. <laughs> I mean, not in Oklahoma, at least. Ice hockey, Dallas Stars, St. Louis Blues, San Jose Sharks, Nashville Predators. All these games are on here. You don't have to have those $180, $200 uh, bills for cable anymore. And this is live, so, I mean, I'm stuttering a little bit. I'm sorry. But I'm going to be putting this on my sales topics, too, so you guys can see exactly what it is. And I'll show you a little demo on how to do things at my house as well. Programs. You can add other um, add-ons or other programs. Hell, let's go to maintenance. This is what a lot of people don't understand now, and I definitely wanted to show you. It was under programs. Clear the cache. Clearing your cache is basically the same thing as clearing your cache on the computer. If a site is not working correctly, what's the one thing main IT people tell you to do? Hey, did you clear your cookies? Clear your cache? Same thing. So I'm actually going to clear it, and I found 14 temp files. Let's go to purge packages. Think of it as like an oil change for your device. There you go. There was no packages. And I do this once uh, uh, once a week. I do this one once a day, clear cache, purge packages once a week, and clear thumbnails maybe twice every month or so. Just depends. If I have an update, which I will because I keep up to date on stuff, you'll automatically get the update alert from my Facebook but you'll click one button. You'll just click one button and then hit the home button on your remote, and you're done. But before you do that, back up your stuff, because if you do have favorites, please put it in your settings and put it in your path that you've saved it in. Preferably get a USB drive. It would help you a lot. People wanted weather. I definitely got them the weather here. You have other add-ons you can add on here. Um, as you see in the corner, very, very, very um, in the corner, and it, you can't really see it, but it says the Civil War Build 1.1. Well, I messed up and did not put it in the middle or where it's centered. But you'll see 1.1. 1 .1. <laughs> That's the newest build. So anytime I have the next build come out, it'll say 1.2, 1.3, 1.4, etc. Let's go to the next tab. Power. This is how you turn off your device and get out of Kodi. Kodi will automatically reboot and go to the blue screen of death is what I call it, where there's no add-ons, you think, but it's just the skin. But if you power it off by going to power and then quit, you won't have that issue. 
<clears throat> but this is why I sell it because whenever you do buy a box, you literally can get rid of cable. You really can watch anything possible. But this is my NVIDIA Shield. Like I said, if you guys want a box, let me know. And thank you for viewing.